Hey guys, so I'm working on cards. I just got some things at Hobby Lobby to create um, this one right here. And I actually had someone ask me to make them a couple and that was like super exciting for me. And that is the envelope of the card I just showed you. These are made to order. I'm so excited. made cards packaged and ready to go here's some that need to go in envelopes or uh, plastic covers I met so I recently got three pair of these and they're all different I'm trying to show you you see the design here how where is it there it is see this one's a squiggly Oh, pfft, there we go. I love these. Also got these. Love them. And I have one other pair. And they're great. So in my Hobby Lobby haul, I had to buy some more supplies pretty much to make those cards, which would be this blue ribbon here. Almost out of it. Actually, I think this is slightly different. This one's a little bit more darker. I'm really excited about that and a little bit thicker, so this will be better. And I got my papers. I bought some other papers just because they're pretty and I'm going to decorate my envelopes with this beautiful letters it's very vintage antique looking and I got my pretty spring polka dots all right and then I had got my buttons for those cards and I don't know if I showed you guys these last time but I got these adorable stamps it says grow in his love Ephesians 317 and I got it half off and I got this pretty design here Okay, and um, then I got this paper just because it's really pretty. Whoops, I'm gonna make some a new design with this eventually. Let me try and show you. There's some really unique vintage patterns in here. Get the little typewriter. Show you. Oh, here's a pr really pretty pattern here. Here's a beautiful pattern that I like. Oh, this one's just alphabet. And this one. It's very pretty. I'll skip some nice ones at the back here. But see the beautiful like vintage patterns of these can make some really beautiful cards. And this one has like the postcard with the roses and I love that style love 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 that style oh here's some more more postcards with roses stamps oh it's so gorgeous I would say this is my absolute favorite style for card making and another one of these so yeah this book I did not get half off 
I went ahead and paid full price for it because I had a gift card and I figured, you know what, I'm going to buy full price from them once in a while. But anyway. Then I got all these buttons. These will be for more of a spring decoration. And I don't want them to be too kiddish, but just fun. Fun, but not like little kid boring, you know. I just love spring and flowers and colors. So I got a lot of these half off. They're very, very pretty buttons. I think I got one, two, about five or six packs. I think I bought them all out. But they're so beautiful and they're gonna go on my cards. Oh, man, I got so many fun projects. And I want to recreate some old projects that I have as well. So there's that. And I got these pretty stamps. Um, 74 cents. So this was like more than half off. And these are going to be just to put on my envelopes. I got two of those. For, and they're each 74 cents. Usually they're $2.99 and I get them half off. So about $1.49. Then I got some more of these. These are some of my classic favorite stickers that I always have to restore when I run out, but yeah. Um, this pretty ribbon, I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to do with it. I was thinking about wrapping my um, sunshine hat with it actually around the um, edge because I love daisies. Y'all know that. So I'm not sure if I'm going to use this on cards. This is just for me. <laughs> um, and then these keys. Oh yeah. Okay. These keys are going to make a beautiful project. In fact, these papers and these keys might be in the same project right here. So I have so many things to work on. It's so exciting. And I was just looking through my pack here of cards that I've made and I'm going, wow, those are really pretty. I think I'll make some more of those. And I just want to go through here. And maybe make some more of some of these. Like, let me show you here. This one, I like this one a lot. That's one that I made for my friend. And it has like a really cute envelope. Okay, I love that one. I kind of like these with the musical note. Oh, I just, you know, it's kind of basic, but at the same time, it has a really cute envelope there. Oh, and it was these that I want to make more of. Oh, yeah. Okay, these are trifold cards. So you open each side. And I try, of course, keep those kind of vintage. And I got my Jesus paid it off, my stamp there, and my doily and sticker. So I'd have to open this up to actually show you what the inside looks like. Oh. Yeah, because these are actually designed in the inside, and they're really fun. I have a lot more blank... Um, Trifold. I'm going to come over here so I can make more of these. So I have lots of old projects I got to work on and new projects. Only thing is I don't have all the supplies I need. I'll have to run to Hobby Lobby several times to continue making all these things because I run out of stuff. And so these cards are special because they have the inside musical uh, hymn papers with pretty stickers and then I got one of my handmade with love stickers in there and they're all stamped this one got kind of greasy Ugh. but yeah so that's a project I'm gonna be making more of and I actually bought, um, today when I went to my vet appointment for my dog, I went on Facebook Marketplace and found some mail divider slots from the office. I'm really excited to get that in my room, stack it up top of my uh, cabinet here, and it's all kinds of slots for like business sheets and papers, but I'm going to put my cards in them. Yay! Because look, this is what I'm working with right now. I don't have room for all my cards at all. So you don't, it's just half of these are being used for supplies. Yeah, so 
I'm excited about that. Just thought I'd share what's going on. Everything's going wonderful here, guys. Oh, I'm blessed. I hope you are too. Anyways, have a good day. It's raining here, but it's nice. Could be a lot colder. It was really cold last week. Anyways, God's doing some really cool things around here. Really. Always. He's always up to something in my life. Always up to something. Usually it's stuff he's teaching me. Or reteaching me. And I love him for it. Anyways, I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>